Show. Hey, right back at you guys, it's your favorite Minecraft Pocket Edition Parkour YouTuber here, and today I'm back with a brand new server review t video, vi what the heck, video. Today I'm going to be reviewing the all new 0.12.0 economy server built by me, my sis, and my other staff members. That will be coming soon to 0.12.0, and uh, yeah, so this is the entire server. Uh, let's just look around and then we'll show you. We're, we're gonna like sh tell you how to play. Oh yeah, uh, my sister's in the background, so say hello, Gabix Riella Craft. Hi. Say it louder. I don't think the mic caught that. Hello. And uh, yeah, so, uh, so we're just gonna be reviewing like how this goes, and we'll also be reviewing some of the buildings as well. Now, uh, so why don't I? Okay, this thing is lagging. All right, so, uh, I'm just gonna be showing around and uh, explaining how, um like how to play. So basically this is going to be an economy server. Basically the object of the server is you'll be able to like um there's not there's not really a lot of economy servers for MCPE. Like there is some but not a lot. And uh my goal is to actually make this one of the biggest economy servers ever mostly cuz there really isn't a lot of server. But basically the object of the server is you can basically uh, when you first join the server, you uh, you um, spawn with ten thousand in-game money or ten thousand dollars, and uh, basically you can uh, buy your own house and stuff, or even build your own house. But uh, it is actually it costs more to build your own house and to also create your own business. And uh, how to gain more money, you just have to like create your own business, sell stuff, and uh, why don't I um return bobbing off? All right, and uh, base and uh, yeah, so um. You can either create your own business or you can uh, work for another business. But uh, it is it actually does cost to uh, create your own house and to create your own business. Uh, obviously, to rent a house or an apartment room in a skyscraper, you still have to pay, but it's more if you're just going to build your own house. And uh, for business, just creating a business, basically, um, it, just creating a business, you already have to pay for it. Um, but if you're just gonna like work for another business, you don't have to pay for it. It is automatically free. But the thing about owning your own business is you get to make the rules of your own business, and uh, you can hire wherever you whatever you want. And uh, yeah, so why don't I go to the spawn area right over here? You'll be spawning down here. And uh, welcome to Paradise X City. That is the name of the server, the Paradise X City, aka the PXC server. Proceed um, forward, then right, to go into the demographics tower. So that tower right over here, the weird looking glass and stone brick tower right there has like all the city info and stuff. And uh, sorry about... Uh, we're back, guys. Sorry about that. Um, an email just popped up on my screen, a notification. And uh, yeah, I don't want anyone to like, you know, spam that email and stuff. And uh, yeah, so just proceed into that tower to go to the to view the demographics. And uh, oh yeah, by the way, by the time you guys are watching this... um. You guys are probably going to be wondering, wait, where did this building that you posted earlier, where is that? Well, basically, because I have pre-recorded videos, like, by the time, you, like, by the, like, um, by the time you guys watch, by the time you guys watch this, like, I'll actually, like, how do I explain this? Like, I don't know, I just, we just built, me and our staff, we just build every day, like, for, like, we just build every day. And All right, and we're back, guys, sorry about that, uh, I just got a FaceTime audio call from my, uh, my friend, the Cats Gaming, so, uh, Hold on, uh, Gamex Riella wanted to show us something, uh, what did you do? You spawned a... It died. Oh. He crushed the skeleton in the rock, and it died. Let's try to do it again. You s oh, yeah, anyway, she spawned the spider jockey. But, uh, yeah, so basically, the original social media that I came from, which is where most of my YouTube audience come from, and most of you guys already know this, is Instagram, so I always post what's new in the server, what we build. And, uh, so you guys, by the time you're watching this, you're probably wondering, wait, where's this? Where's this skyscraper? Where's this building? Well, that's because I pre-record videos. I'm recording this right now on the date July 8th, so, um, yeah. So, when you turn around, it'll say proceed forward into the town hall for rules and secrets. Over here, it'll just say the map main creators, and, uh, yeah. So, in the town hall, it'll basically have, like, all the laws and the economy info and the rules, and, uh, yeah. So, and we'll also be building a tour train right over here, which tours the entire city. And there's my sis, Gabix Riella, aka Gabix Riella Craft. I'll have her, uh, social media in the description below. And, uh, please, no, um, spawning Mr. Spiders. Okay. Yeah, I'm holding a hole in my inventory, that's why. And, uh, yeah. So, um, yeah. And, uh,. There are, there's also another way to make money just besides making business. You can also PvP, there will be a PvP arena, 
But um, keep in mind that when you do PvP, it is much more easier than business. But the thing about it is, it is way slower because of like it is way slower. And what I mean by that is because like each kill, you'll get like one dollar, two dollars, and you know like everything. And you know, like maybe even ten, five dollars, and like everything else in here is like maybe like a hundred dollars, a thousand, and depending on how much money you get, you can also receive special ranks. Like you can get like a millionaire rank, a noble rank, a billionaire rank. Of course, there won't be a poor rank, because I don't think anyone would be poor in this server unless you decide to be stupid and spend all your money on stupid stuff. And uh, yeah, so um, right now this is currently a zoo. So um, Gab, why don't you show us a little bit about the zoo? So why don't you just come to the front and then. You can uh, navigate us, but be sure to talk loud since you're a little far from the mic. Okay, so here we have the overgrown vines. Which I destroyed. This is, I called it the mob house. I might change the name later. So follow us in. Oh my gosh, the lag. Are you in? Yeah, sorry, the lag. So first off, this is going to be a fountain, but right now it's just a sculpture. And... Over here, it takes you to the different divisions of the zoo or the mob house. So on the left, we're going to have all the mobs. Well, the dangerous mobs, the ones that you kill. The ones that are out to kill you and don't like you. The hostile mobs. Yes. And over here, we have the animal pens and the squid tank at the end of the hall. In front is going to be a gift shop, or I think. I'm not sure what it'll be yet, but there's nothing there right now. So we'll see after I finish the mobs. So, we can go to the animals first, since I finished this part of the zoo. On your left, we are approaching a sheep habitat. Nice pink sheep. Yes, yes, it's very pink. We have some sheep over here with the grass, and if you can see there's a fences, I'm going to make um, something else connected to that later. So, it's just, it just looks weird right now. And over here we have the cows. Hello cows, how are you doing? And on, if you go ahead, we have some, a chicken pen over here with our lovely chickens. And we have a pig glitching out of the glass. And it's not anymore. We have our piggies over here. I love the piggies. Love the lag though. At the end we have our mushrooms that live with all these Mushrooms. <laughs> yes, hi. Hello. And what's on this side? And these are our wolves. None of them are tamed, so that they are able to run free. Not necessarily free, but they're able to run. And like, not just sit all the time. Yes, and just stare at you. I think there's a block missing. Hold on. Oh, there's a block missing. Oops. Okay, there we go. Over here, as you can see, the side says the squid tank. In we go. So over here, you can't really see any squids right now. I think I might need to spawn more. Yeah. I think they all despawned. No, I just spawned some more yesterday. Oh well. I'll spawn more when I go up there. Oh yeah, they all despawned. Okay. There's like none up here. Okay, you take this ladder up. Oh wow, what happened to them? They're all gone. But uh, yeah, why don't you uh, spawn them so that uh, everyone can will know what they uh, look like. And uh, yeah, so that's what they all look like. You can see them through the glass clearly, so uh, it's not hard. Originally, we tried to make it so that when you look up, you'll see the squids, but uh, that didn't turn out good because you could barely see them. So we just made them on the side that you can see them, and then when you climb up the ladder, you can just uh, look down, and then you'll be able to see them. And uh, of course, the lag, uh, screen record is lagging right now, so yeah, there you go. And I do not recommend X Mirage as a screen recorder you guys should use. And uh, yeah, why don't you uh, take us through what you've built so far in the mob area. Okay. So right now it's mostly open because I'm not done yet. I need to finish the animal pens but the top. But the main part of it is done. So as you can see the ground is sort of made to look like as if you were in the habitat. So there's grass and mycelium over there. And then it turns into sand for the squids. Mm. On the left side. Oh, really? Whatever. Oh, the vines. Oh, that was not what I meant. Hold up. Hold up. 
Oh my gosh. It's... And that's how babies are made, kids. Good. Yes. So why don't you take us through over here? Okay. Give me a second. Okay. Here on the pond on the left, we have our zombies. Too bad none of them were babies. Let's try to spawn a baby one. Is my brightness all the way up? Oh no, it's not. Let me turn it up so you guys can see. So you guys can have a better l view. A better Dang look it! At them. No baby zombies. I like those. They run really fast. On our left, I mean your right, we have our skeletons. Hello, skellies. How are you? Okay. We go further. We have spiders over here. I spawned the spider jockeys a couple times, but they the spiders climb up the walls and they smash them in the ceiling and they die. Very smart spiders. So yeah. And over here we have our creepers. Hello creepers. And this. I like yeah. how you put the sand there, it kinda matches. And I put I put iron bars here because I don't know, it just matches more. The lag. Oh my gosh. Or over here, we have our bats. Sometimes they fly around, sometimes they stay on the ceiling. Earlier they were flying around. Now they're just being like that. Come on. Do something. The public is watching. Okay. And over here, here you can see, or her. Here you can see there's nothing right now. You can see the hospital. Uh, yeah. And so over here, I'm going to make an elevator or some ladders going up, and then I'll continue more of the animal pens in the second floor of the mob part. And I'll add zombie pigmen, I'll add some silverfish, I'll add some magma cubes, slimes, cave spiders, all that junk. I was going to add endermen, but those things can teleport out, so that's not a good idea to have endermen running across the city. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you don't want to go to the library and see an enderman carrying some books. Oh yeah, and this is the library, by the way. Uh, I, I built this. And uh, yeah. yeah, so that's pretty cool, Zoo. Uh, thanks for giving us the tour, Gabex Riola. And don't forget to check out her social media. I'll have them all listed in the description below. And uh, yeah, so I'm just going to review. I'm just going to show off like maybe one, three, two of my creations. Uh, I'm just going to like maybe do two or one. And, uh, but I'm not gonna go through the entire building. So over here we got the uh, hospital. I really, I was really impressed with this design. At first I thought this was gonna be a horrible design, but uh, it turned out pretty good. And uh, yeah, so there's not much really in the hospital yet. I didn't like put all the beds and stuffs in it yet, but uh, we have a couple floors. We have like six floors. And uh, yeah, so um, it's basically uh, not much. And uh, you guys can also own these business buildings, but the first to buy them basically are the ones to own them and uh, remember owning your own business or buying a building is actually uh, expensive you can also buy your own houses like um, obviously that's not what I meant to say like you can also um, create your own houses like you can like literally buy land like you can buy the landscape from us and then that'll be your land and then you can like build whatever you want there and uh, we'll give you the freedom of creative mode uh, but don't even think of griefing because we'll have grief protection on and uh, yeah, so um, over here we have a couple of more buildings. This is another business building that you can buy. And uh, right there, that that cone, that weird looking skyscraper that I built, that was the, uh, that's the PXC, which is short for the Paradise X City skyscraper. And over here we have the MCL Tower, which is basically a really huge tower with a lot of floors. I didn't build all the floors yet because I kind of just got lazy, but... Uh, I'll use World Edit for this to build the floors, and uh, yeah, they're real expensive. For these skyscrapers, it costs a lot to buy to like just own your own floor. And uh, in apartments, you can own your own floor. It's not just a room because each floor is actually a room. Over here, we have a business building that you can buy. First one to buy it wins, and you can. Be it's like being the CEO of like six b businesses if you buy this entire business building. And uh, yeah, it's really good. We have a shopping center right over here. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. We're gonna expand more and more and more and more and more and uh, we're going to uh, expand more we're gonna make this a really huge city over here is gonna be like a little neighborhood area I'll hire one of my other staffs to build some houses right here because I'm not really good at the houses and over here we have the magnificent ginormous prison that I built it actually took me not much it, it took me like a night and then a, it took me a night and a morning I guess that, that made any sense to build 
And uh, yeah, so sorry this video was so long. Um, but yeah, this is the economy server that's coming soon. It's 0 0.12.0. We don't have an official release date for it yet. But uh, we will tell you it is coming soon. And uh, yeah, so also don't forget to check out the zoo. This is a really amazing zoo. She spent, my sister spent a really long time on this. And uh, yeah, so this is really amazing. Especially for the squid area because we messed up. So we had to like redo the entire thing. We had to clear up all the water, which took pretty much forever. Um, it was really annoying and also boring. And uh, I also helped uh, some with some of the cleaning. And uh, yeah, so don't forget, uh, I don't have an IP an official IP for this server yet, obviously, because I didn't make the server yet. And, uh, yeah, so, um, any last words? Stay Pikachu. <laughs> I'll never say that again. That was stupid. Stay golden, everyone. And, uh, any questions? I'll actually answer all comments for this video, like, to answer your questions. But, uh, if you've commented on this video, like, a week after it was uploaded, I won't be able to reply to it. But yeah, guys, hope you all do enjoy this um, server. Hope you guys do um, join the server. And uh, yeah, this was the in this was the city. This is what the si what what it looks like so far. When and a spider glitches out. Uh, yeah. So thank you all for watching and stay golden, everyone. Don't do it.